Thank you for stopping by. This is Truth Goddess Tarot 777. Hello, today's read is for you, Sag. Thank you for stopping by. Like, comment, and subscribe to the page. All right, Sagittarius, of course, have been shuffled. They've been prayed and meditated over. All right, clarify the cards. Draw our energy for Sag. Now, the first card that came out was the Sun card, right? This is talking about you having excitement, being creative. Wow. Okay. Looks like this is about somebody's finances when they were in a toxic relationship. This could be you or somebody else. Um, someone is broken up and they're having trouble with their finances in a toxic relationship. This person may have had you in a third party relationship. Um but it looks like the sun court is talking about happiness, being creative, starting a new love. Now, the time to romance. This card came out kind of in a, eh, looked like it was trying to come forward. So you're being creative. You're working on your creative skills. You're excited about what you're doing. There's excitement coming your way that's going to be an opportunity for love. I see a storm warning. Now, this card, the storm warning, if I'm not mistaken, this card is talking about be aware of something coming your way. The Archangel Ariel is also talking about intimacy and creativity. So, this is somebody, because I clarified the storm warning, because I want to know what exactly is the storm warning. What exactly is the storm warning? Clarify that for Sag. What is the storm warning? So, again, you're happy creating um, whatever that you find to be exciting. Um, somebody, okay, wow. Hmm. So, the storm warning is talking about warmth, family. Hmm indecisive and making a choice pleasant visit and crown you may have you may need help from others hmm and disappointments and anxiety brewing jealousy bad relationships with others so spirit is saying wow there's a storm warning there's going to be a problem with somebody in your family indecisive and making choices so somebody possibly making life difficult in your family um as the crown in reverse you may have you may need help from others disappointments anxiety brewing so there's some sort of anxiety brewing and it's with your family hmm difficult times ahead so something about your family spirit is warning you to be aware that there's going to be an issue happening in your family hmm this may have a lot to do with wow strong framework possibly wow jeez Hopefully, and I'm hoping and praying this is not true for you guys. We'll say that it's about emptiness, destructive, indecisive, immorality, protection from evil spirits. So there's a storm warning coming in your life, and it has to do with those around you. So it's about people around you. With the crown being in reverse. Let's see. The storm warning. New relationships are coming in. So you're going to have obviously a new opportunity. Spirit is saying be patient. And emotional or financial crisis. Pleasant visit. So. Hmm. But. There's somebody, again, this could be a family member as well that's holding on, that was being stingy, 
holding back. Somebody in your somebody from your past was holding back, showing any real love and emotion. This person is being blocked, stopped. They're they're ha possibly having car problems. This is this could be a child that possibly you were holding on because this is family. This is children, someone that you love. A child that you're holding on to them, possibly crying because this person is having issues moving forward, becoming successful. They're not able to overcome. Whoever this person is, this is a past relationship. This is somebody that's looking at your photos. So this could be anyone. This is somebody that's very nostalgic. But Spirit is saying it's time for you to make new memories. And I feel like you're doing that with the Sun Core. You're excited about a new romance coming in your life. And then we have Archangel Ariel. This person and or you are being creative. Because Archangel Ariel is very artistic um, and very... He's an angel that is... When it comes to love in combination with creativity. So you're happy waiting for love, but the storm warning is somebody else was in a situation in which all that glitters is not gold. The truth be told, spirit is saying a change in the wind. So it's like somebody from your past is now reminiscing and holding on to maybe a marriage, a love, a new beginning. And they're crying because this person has been blocked from your life. Again, for this, all that glitters is not gold. This could be somebody that was dealing with someone that is darker than lighter. Dealings in a relationship with a woman with a broken relationship. Unsuccessful outcome to a problem. So... It's like this person sees that you're happy in love and that you're also being creative as well. Now, it shows me that there's plenty of material things. This could be you. Dealings in a relationship with a woman, blonde, gray, or white hair. This person may be someone that's being supportive of you when it comes to your career. Because we're talking about taking a vacation physically or mentally. Maybe you'll be taking a vacation. Um, I also see disappointments in the friend or a lover. So there's a lot going on here, Sag. I'm going to clarify a card or two. And let's see what we have here. So it looks like the door to you and yeah, you're preparing yourself to be in a marriage, a committed relationship. We're going to clarify this fair woman. What is it the Sass needs to know? And again, take the roles as they apply. Put yourself in the places where they belong. What is it that Sass needs to know about the fair woman with blonde hair, gray hair, or white hair? Clarified, okay. Hmm. Um, somebody, okay, you're this blonde woman or there's a truce. This is somebody that was being blinded, that was being controlled. Soulmates at the bottom of the deck. Clarify the fair woman for Sag. What is it? Clarify the fair woman. Who is this fair woman to Sag? Again, this could be you. And take the rules. It could be a male as well. Okay. Okay. Something about this fair woman is highly intuitive and gifted. I feel like that's you. Being it's the high priestess. It's like you, you know. Hmm. Okay, the page of pentacle. You that you have a new idea or 
Okay. So as a high priestess, you know the mysteries of the a new beginning that someone is wanting to come to you. So somebody is looking to um, be mysterious and come towards you. They're coming to lie to you. There's somebody that's, they want to show you love. King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So it's, to me, this fair male or woman, clarify the Seven of Swords. So I feel like you know that somebody has this idea of trying to lie and be deceitful. <laughs> yeah. This is somebody that's coming to lie, to cheat, to be deceptive to you. Wow. Let's find out something. So this person is looking to present themselves to you with an offer, a new idea, a new beginning. But they're going to be deceitful and betray you and lie. Whoever this uh, this person could have done this to you. Clarify the fair woman. So as the high priestess, this is you, Sage. You know the person is... Clarify the page of, pen, page of pentacles. So somebody knows that... Clarify the page of pentacles. It's like somebody knows that you're being... That, okay, a sick crust. That's what I thought. So you already know that somebody's watching you and they're looking to be deceitful to hurt you. Somebody is watching this fair woman, male or female, it doesn't matter. You already know the mysteries and the hidden reason why this person wants to come in. This person has a secret crush. This is somebody that, huh, they want your attention. So this person is looking to lie, steal, cheat, just to get your attention. But this is somebody that wants to hurt you. This is so twisted. Oh my gosh, this person wants to pay you for a hookup. This is what this person wants to do. Oh my goodness. This is a person says they want to come in and pay you 